don't seem that enthusiastic in this video. I broke my nose on Monday and my face really hurts. It's not a good time. I'm not feeling 100%. Kind of hopped up on Tylenol and Advil and all that pain medication stuff. So I'm really sorry if I seem kind of out there today. Sorry. Also, I know I have a volcano on my face. It's a struggle. It's a good time for me. But I thought maybe if I do really bright lips, you won't notice it. And if I just point it out, then y'all can't say anything. So this is Mount Everest. How you doing? We like to call her Veronica. She's my twin sister. We love her very much here in this family. Okay. <laughs> Jay and I'm here with my August wrap up. This is going to be a super short video. I read nine books but most of them are in my booktubeathon wrap up which I will leave down below. If you guys want a review of any of those books let me know because nobody actually commented on the other video saying they wanted reviews of them so I didn't give any. Go check that video out and let me know in this video if you want reviews or on that video whichever works for me going to show you guys the other two books that I read not for the booktubeathon. Let us get started! <sighs> First book I read was Dead to You by Lisa McMahon. I'm going to have a review of this book up shortly, probably in the next week or two, so if you want to know my full thoughts on that, wait for that video. I gave this book a 4.5 out of 5 stars on Goodreads. I read or I guess technically the ninth book, the ninth book I read in August, is Half Bad by Sally Green. I gave this book a 4 out of 5 stars on Goodreads. It's about a boy named Nathan who is half good witch, half bad witch. The good witches are the white witches and the bad witches are the black witches. And his father is Marcus who is the most notorious black witch in the entire world. And he follows Nathan and his journey to survive until his 17th birthday so he can receive three gifts which will make him into a full-fledged witch. I absolutely loved this book. I gave it a so good and entertaining and the story was really unique and the writing style was amazing. I absolutely love Nathan as a main character. His character was so heartbreaking and he never gave up no matter what. Even though all the white witches tried to bring him down, he did not give up and I respect that. Good for you, Nathan. You rock. If you guys want like a more in-depth review of this, totally let me know down below and I'd be happy to do it because it was a super good book. Okay, so that was the two books, number eight and nine, that I read in August. If you want to go check out my booktubeathon, readathon, whatever it's called, wrap-up video, you can see the other seven books that I read this month. And I will see you in my next video. Goodbye. What is the name of this book? It's called Half Bad. Journey. Is it a journey? I don't know. Adventure? I don't know. Survival? How do I say this? What is life? I was gonna say wishes, but they're not wishes.